You want to go to Target? Yeah! Maya's coming too? Yeah, Maya's coming too. Yeah! Hey guys, what's up? It's Raven. Welcome back to another vlog. Today is going to be a shop with us vlog. As you guys know, I just recently moved into this house and there is a lot of stuff that I need to buy. Some just like household essentials and then of course furniture, decor, all types of stuff, organizational baskets and bins and drawer liners and stuff for the kitchen. The list goes on and on. So today we are going to take a trip to Target. Yeah! Are you excited to go to Target? Yeah! Now I actually have a good excuse to be going to Target all the time and Home Goods and all those places because I actually do really need stuff so you can't say anything to me. My hair is still damp from my shower this morning so you guys will probably see it progressively get fluffier throughout this vlog. So I've been making a list of all the stuff that I need. This is like kitchen stuff, just regular house stuff. I also made a list for the master bathroom, closet. I need a bunch of stuff and this is just like like a starter list of like most stuff that I know I can get at Target, but there's so much more other than this. I'm just gonna start with like some essential starter items at Target today, and then eventually I'll probably be making more vlogs, shopping out more places, and getting more stuff. So stay tuned for lots of shopping on my channel. All right, you ready to go? Yeah! Maya is here acting like a dead zombie. <laughs> But she will be joining us for this excursion. Is that your baby? What's your baby's name? You don't know? You don't know your own baby's name? What's your baby's name? You don't know? You have to give her a name. Oh, your baby! You can't throw your baby on the floor. Oh, you have to be gentle with the baby. Are you gonna take your baby to the store? All right, let's go. Go! We're here. Wake up! Wake your booty up. Zaya, are you awake? Come on, we going to Target. Get hype. Get hype. <laughs> I guess Target doesn't hype other people up like it hypes me up. Let's see. First, I know I need some containers. Uh, you need a rug for your playroom. I don't know if they have one here that I would like. I also need like a kitchen sink rug, whatever it's called. Eh, I'm not sold. Y'all see how I just finessed that with one hand? Out of all these, I would say either this one or this one. Which one do you like for my kitchen? Or should I keep looking somewhere else? I think I'm just gonna keep looking. I'll check home goods. Low key, this bookshelf is the exact type of bookshelf I'm looking for for the living room. Black iron, light colored wood. Mm, it might be a little small. Actually, I think this might be the right size. Okay, I'm gonna keep this in mind. This is pretty much exactly what I plan on doing. A living room is just have like decorative pieces on it. Or maybe even this one. It's more of a grayish wood. I like this stuff maybe for my office i have that i have that and i have that <laughs> and i have that plants yes oh i like this little setup right here too this black thing would go good in the kitchen the basket is 40 dollars jeez louise okay but how much is this one 80 dollars fake plants are expensive y'all i need these for my bathroom because I had some of these color, but we're over this phase of my home decor life. You have to hold them, Zaya, because you're in the way. Or put them down by your feet. I haven't really gotten to decorating Zaya's room yet, but I know when I get there, I will be over in this section. They have really cute stuff. Oh, this is cute because I'm thinking about doing a cloud theme in her room. This is like a little cloud shelf. I can get a couple of these. That'll be cute. Oh, look, a rainbow neon sign thing. Oh yeah, I'm gonna definitely come back for stuff for her room. So I've decided to get black washcloths, face towels, face towels, whatever you want to call them, because I feel like I destroy the white ones so much with makeup and stuff that if I get black, black still kind of matches with my bathroom and they won't get destroyed. 
But Target has a lot of cute colors of towels if you guys want to like match your bathroom decor. So I wanted to get a new electric toothbrush. I've heard about these and I was gonna get the gold one, but how come the gold one and the rose gold is 40, but the blue and green are 25? And the only difference is the color. A whole scam, but you know I gotta get the gold. So managed to spend ooh, $200 at Target. Really only got a few basic things like stuff for my bathroom, kind of boring stuff, not really any like decor. I mean, I got Zaya a shower curtain rod, a shower curtain. I got some, some containers. I got like just some random stuff, some bug spray. So I want to actually go look at home goods real quick just to browse through and see what they have in terms of like kitchen and bathroom stuff. And then we will head home. Could get some cute sparkly stuff for Zaya's bathroom. This is cute since we got her a blush pink um, shower curtain. I found these um, wooden. Hey, let me show the people. The drawer divider thingies, expandable for like your silverware. And these are $12.99. I saw a similar thing at Target for like $20. So this is a really good deal on these two. I'm trying to see, should I just get like a cute disposable thing of soap or an actual soap dispenser for Zaya's bathroom? I like this one. But I do like this, like for the kitchen. It's kind of gross, but I can clean it off. Mommy, I go potty. You need to go potty? Okay, hold on. Potty break. Are you done? Yeah. Hands clean? Yeah. You ready to go back shopping? Yeah. It's bad when you go in a store and all you really see is a bunch of stuff you already have. You like that dinosaur thing? I think you're almost too big for that already. You're outgrowing a lot of baby stuff. You have to get big girl stuff now. So I just came across these bookends with these sparkly crystals on. I think they're so cute. And I'm gonna get two of them because I have an idea on how I can use these in my glam room. Look how pretty. What is that? Ice cream. Ice cream glass markers. You don't even know what that is. You don't need that. It's not a toy. I think this would be perfect no, for the this. mail room. What's this? No. Sorting no, papers this. and mail and no, stuff. This. No, this. You're just pointing at random stuff now. What's Let me get this. So we're back home. I dropped Maya off at my mom's house because she wasn't feeling good. Huh? At Grammy's house. Sorry. Zaya and I are taking a lunch break. We got tropical. Uh, what is this place called again? Tropical Smoothie Cafe. I've been eating this nonstop. It's like my favorite thing right now. Yeah. You got a smoothie too? I think it's C-A-F-E, and that spells cafe. Look, C A F D. No, what letter is that? D. E, E for elephant. Are you forgetting your letters? Do we need to do alphabet review? And I'm just too. Yes, I have it on mine too. Their Thanks. summer drink, the watermelon mojito, is really good, highly recommend. Zaya is still in her picky eater phase. Not even picky eater, but just like doesn't like to eat, period. <laughs> You're doing a good job though. Okay, chew and swallow. Okay, so let's do a little haul of everything that I bought today. Starting off with the random boring stuff. Dish soap, because I need to wash dishes and I like to keep my dish soap in this decorative uh, soap dispenser that I got from Target. I think I said that earlier when we were in Target. I think this is really meant for like your bathroom. 
but it's cute it matches my kitchen so i just buy the jumbo thing of dish soap and refill this thing then i got some raid bug barrier you like spray this around your doors and windows to keep bugs from coming in your house so i need that then i got some off mosquito repellent because when we're chilling on the back patio mosquitoes are real bad where i live so we need this then i got some self-adherent wrap like where you like wrap up injuries because if you don't follow me on twitter i think i broke my toe and I need to wrap it up because it really hurts. <laughs> then I got this $40 electric battery operated toothbrush because I like using an electric toothbrush and this one is cute and I've seen it on YouTube. So I bought it and I really wanted the gold one even though it was $15 more. I got five like washcloth bath towels in black in like the nice thick soft ones. I got Zaya a shower curtain that looks like this. I think it's still like cute for a little girl's bathroom, but it's not quite as childish as her old shower curtain, which is like really like brightly colored printed. You know, it's a little jarring. So this one's a little bit more toned down, a tiny bit more grown up. And then I also got her one of these little curtain rod, shower curtain thingies. I got two wooden kitchen utensils. Really, I don't even plan on cooking with these. I just got them for decor purposes to look cute in my little jar on my countertop. And then one like black rubber spatula. I did actually need this. I probably will actually use this, but it matches my kitchen as well. Then I got three of these plastic soap dispensers. I thought they would be really cute for my shower because in my shower I have like a little cubby thing built in where you can keep your products but I think it looks really cluttered when you just have like a bunch of random products in your shower so I just really want to keep shampoo, conditioner, body wash in there. It'll look really you know aesthetic in my shower. Then I got a bunch of these gray plastic bins because I need them for my bathroom stuff. And that was pretty much all I got from Target. Moving on to home goods, I got two of these bamboo, I think it's bamboo. Yeah, bamboo utensil tray to go in my kitchen drawer. So like a bigger one for spatulas and stuff. And this one is more for like my forks, spoons, knives, whatever else on the sides. This is the one I had. I mean, it's functional. It does its job, but it's just, you know, it doesn't match my aesthetic. Ooh, this one fits perfectly, yes. I love this. And it just looks like it was like, you know, made for this drawer. Like it looks fancy, like it was built in. Yes, this is so satisfying to me. Am I the only one who finds this type of stuff satisfying? Then I got this cute little soap dispenser for Zaya's bathroom, gold and blush pink with like this little swirly glass design. So I thought it would pair nicely with her new shower curtains. Then I got these two crystal diamond iridescent bookends. These were $14.99 each, but I, they're like really hefty. Like this is like solid glass so these are like really nice really really pretty and i plan on using these in my glam room you guys will see in a future video when i actually decorate my glam room so the same way that you would like stack up books i would put my makeup palettes between these get it because it's like the glam room because it's like sparkling you know next i just got some tarani uh vanilla french vanilla syrup this is what i use to sweeten my coffee and they always have it at home goods for a good price and then i got this really nice giant glass jar of of hand soap and it smells really good and I just thought this was like a very pretty bottle I think I subconsciously wanted to buy this because of Desi Perkins's kitchen tour that she did she mentioned how she likes to get nice glass bottles of soap from home goods and it might have even been the same exact one I'm not sure but I feel like this would just look really nice in my kitchen and it's a lot of soap and it smells really good and it was $7.99 so I thought that was a good buy and then I got these kitchen towels, solid black and then uh, white with black stripes. These were $6.99 for four towels, so not bad. And they feel pretty high quality. And the last thing I got from Home Goods is the mail sorter thingy mababi basket basket on a piece of wood three baskets on a piece of wood <laughs> whatever you want to call this it has a space where you can put labels like if i want to use it for like 
mail, imported papers, Zaya stuff, whatever. This was only 20 bucks, so I bought that to put in the mail room. If you guys follow me on Instagram, I posted on my story the other day that I wanted to challenge my mom and my little sister to decorate the mail room assistant office place. So I'm kind of like cheating by already buying this for that room but you know it doesn't matter they can get all the rest of this stuff and yeah that's my whole haul for today yeah, butterfly. butterfly uh oh i think it's dead poor little thing it's pretty though oh, it's sit down hold on with your hands hold on to the chain no, ready one <laughs> two three <laughs> But I don't know what's wrong with my toe, but it literally hurts so bad. So I wrapped it up and it feels better actually. I can walk on it a little better. Pretty. I see you. I see you. I see you. I walk. <laughs> All right guys, I'm gonna go ahead and end this vlog here. We're just having some little playground time, you know, living that suburban life, you know, just taking my kid to the playground to, you know, get her energy out before bedtime. Gonna cook a nice casserole for dinner. But yeah, that's it for this vlog. I hope you enjoyed the shop with me and the little haul. Let me know if you like this type of video. Subscribe if you haven't already. I'll be doing a lot more shopping, decorating. I know this video was kind of like basic, like the stuff I got was really basic but I will be buying furniture and actual decor and stuff in my other videos. Anyways, like this video if you liked it. Subscribe if you haven't already. Stay tuned for more house stuff to come, and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye. Say bye, Zaya. Bye.